Hello everybody, Scott Golden here with the Golden Opportunities Coaching YouTube channel. Welcome to those of you who are new. Welcome back to those who are seasoned veterans of what we do around here. What we do around here is bring about conversations of a psychological, mental, and emotional health paradigm. We do that as often as we can, usually several times per week. We try to connect that on a deeper level for a number of reasons, usually because it is beneficial to those who are listening. We have over a thousand audios available on a variety of topics which can lead you in a positive direction if you are so inclined to go that way. This is our Life Lesson Series. This is number 135. We continue to add to these on as often as we can. If you're looking for ways to kind of muddle through what life is trying to teach you, would love to be of assistance to you in that way. The first uh, way to contact is through Twitter at PO Perception. The second is through the About Me section of this YouTube page. Either one can lead you in the direction of connecting with me or a member of my team and ultimately lead you to where you need to be. The next thing is, uh, or the first thing to look at is, know how to hustle. So keep moving. Keep moving towards progress, no matter how small. But, but be concerned more with consistency than you are with accomplishment. So people that are more concerned with consistency than they are with accomplishment will be able to accomplish more by proxy because at the end of the day, they will begin to understand the value of their individual actions and the times at which they kind of check out on themselves or shortchange themselves or whatever have you. Now, that doesn't necessarily mean that we shouldn't celebrate accomplishment. Certainly we should. But when we look at consistency more than specific accomplishments, what we're also doing is giving ourselves permission to see the value in the day-to-day -day process and connect on that deeper level. The next thing to consider is uh, understanding how to do that in a uh, proving way. So prove your value by, by making it clear that you are connecting on a level of higher value in so much as we begin to understand the value of knowing how to connect with each other in a manner that is um, both positive, progressive, and consistent, that can be useful. Uh, you know, that's, that's where we go. And ultimately, uh, as, as my phone is going off here, ultimately we get to a place... Um, where we begin to understand that proving ourselves is about the value we bring uh, more than anything else. And that can be super valuable for a number of reasons uh, in, a, in a meaningful and useful perspective. And so the next thing kind of there to look at is... Um, Knowing how to network um, and knowing how to um, use the benefit of the value of relationships. Now, it's not using people, but it's the value of relationships. Every relationship at some level, no matter how large or small, is a, um, you know, is a leverage point. Sometimes it's about learning things. And sometimes it's about growing, sometimes it's about sharing information, sometimes it's about problem solving, but using individual relationships as a point of network is valuable and important and intelligent to be able to do that at the end of the day. When we begin to understand the value of knowing that that needs to be done and beginning to see uh, the connectedness in doing that, we are able to set better long medium and short-term goals the goals we set should be planned but having a flexible plan is much better than having a uh, kind of a, a for lack of better term an, a non-flexible plan or a plan that doesn't necessarily lead us where we want to go the plan that doesn't lead us where we want to go often will um, lead us against our instincts and also lead us to be more fixed a fixed plan often leads to negativity because when things don't go exactly the way we intend, there can be a great deal of challenge with that and also eliminating all hate of and or separation with and as it relates to other people can be 
valuable as well for a number of reasons. There are a number of things that need to be handled. There are a number of things that need to be done. And when you begin to understand how to connect on a deeper level with the opportunities that are in front of you and get rid of hate, that is to exonerate the idea that the illusion of better and worse actually exists beyond our own ego, we then begin, begin to become more susceptible to, you know, some challenges and, and difficulties in that vein. So hopefully this is helpful for your benefit and ultimately uh, we can begin to, uh, you know, uh, challenges in that way. So Hopefully this is helpful. I encourage you to keep your feet on the ground, your mind in the moment. Until next time, everybody.